All right, guys and gals, so you see it back in my native area. <laughs> I'm back in the area that I do best, right? The curb strips. Um, we had a great time in Florida. It was fun. Um, we didn't find a lot, but we had a great time. It was nice and warm down there. Uh, beautiful water and scenery, so we're thankful for that. But now, it's time to spank out some silver coins. So, I got the juice man over there. We're just getting started, and we're going to have a short hunt today, but we're going to see what we can smack out. I'll get you back with me on the first good target. Deep out. <laughs> Alright guys, beep here. So my first target, I thought I was going to have a coin. It's pretty deep, man. It's some kind of old brass. Or, yeah, brass, I'd say, or copper fitting or something. Anyway, it's not what we're looking for, but we'll take it. We'll get on to the silver. Get you on the next good target. Beep out. Alright guys and gals, out in detection land. So I just had a... Uh, it was bouncing from 11, 12, 13 on the knocks. Of course, that's nickel range, uh, but it was showing a good four uh, arrows deep, which is usually four or five inches down. Um, it's about where I find weedies and stuff, so I just dug it anyway. Looks like we got a coin here. I know it's going to be a nickel. <laughs> I just don't know what nickel, right? So let's see if it's an old nickel. I'm pretty sure it's been there a while. But, uh, question is, is how long? Oh, guys, it's a buff. Ha <laughs> ha! It's a buffalo nickel. I can see the buffalo right there. Can y'all see that? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, man. Let's see if I can clean it up just a little bit, guys. Looks like I nicked it. I nicked it on the edge a little bit, it looks like. I don't know if I did it. I didn't, I didn't feel it, but I could have very well. Well, I think it's going to clean up, though. Um, hold on, let me get my glasses on, guys. I might can see a date on it. It looks like the date's still on the shoulder. That's freaking awesome, bro. Oh yeah, it's got a good scratch on it. Um, 1928, guys, right there. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's 1928 Buffalo Nickel. There's the buffalo on the back. It does have a little scratch right there and right there, but nothing new about that. I don't know that I did it, but I guess I did. Um, nevertheless, it's a buffalo nickel, and like I said, I do believe it says 1928. That's awesome, guys. All right, I'll get y'all back with me on the next good target. Deep out. I'm back, baby. <laughs> All right, guys, so I just dug that buffalo nickel right here. I checked it with my pinpointer, I didn't hear anything, uh, but I'm just before I left to check it with my machine, and I don't know if y'all can see that and hear that, but it's reading another nickel. It's reading another nickel. That was about the same depth, a little bit over. Yeah, all right, a little bit over from the other one. Let's see. Uh, that's why my pinpointer didn't get it then. This was the old hole over here, and it's over here somewhere, so. Let's see if we can locate it. I'm going to try my best not to scratch it. I know that. I don't know that I scratched that other one, but it's got a fresh scratch, so I'll take the blame, huh? <laughs> All right. Yeah. 
I try to dig away from wherever the pinpointer says. Uh, All right, we're getting down there, guys. I think this is going to be another one. <gasps> There's something. What is that? Oh, no, that's a rock. That's a rock. All right. Yep, it's right there. So I'm going to try to go over here. Yep. boy come on baby be another buff <laughs> two buffalo nickels in one home make me smiley won't it <laughs> oh no oh there it is guys there it is how you doing looks like another buff guys i believe it's gonna be another buff <laughs> you gotta love that. Let's see. See it? Oh, yeah, baby. It was right at the same depth. It is. It's another buffalo nickel, guys. See the Indian right there. And there's the buffalo. Woohoo! That's freaking awesome, man. Two buffalo nickels in one little hole. Thank you, Curb Strip. Daddy's back. <laughs> I love the beach, guys, but the beach don't have this. Look at that. Don't get me wrong now. I do love gold, and I know gold's worth more. I love rings, but sure uh, fun to find these old coins right look at that two buffalo nickels let's see so this one was um 1930 six, or 26 28 1928 what is this one i don't know what this one is can't see yet guys oh i think this one says 1927 let me get in the sun here Actually, I think this one says 1928, too. I believe they're both 1928. Woohoo! All right, guys, I'll get you with me on the next good target. Two buffalo nickels in the pouch. Cool beans. Beep out. All right, guys, guys I had a nickel signal here. And uh, it wasn't real deep. Uh, I mean, two, two, three inches. And I pulled out this. I don't have any idea what it is. It's some kind of bling on it, but it looks pretty, pretty old. I mean, like it's been in the ground for a while, so I mean. It's heavy. It's, uh, got some weight to it, so. Yeah. Not sure what it is, guys. Piece of jewelry of some kind, I guess. It's little stones set in a some kind of backing. I don't know. Nevertheless, we'll take it and move on, right? All right, I'll get y'all back with me on the next good target. Deep out.